Yo, what is going on YouTube? My name is Beyond from Beyond.com and welcome back to this video where I'm calling a series called Affiliate Tip where I share my own personal experience, my journey as an affiliate online from someone who is making only $100 a month to over 5 figures over a month allow, allow, that allowed me to quit my job and pursue my part-time studies simultaneously and again, by no means this is any formal training it just treated like a conversation between myself to you and I want to share these tips and tricks that hopefully you know you guys can benefit from right so for today's video as you guys may have already seen in the thumbnail or in the title it is called go to the challenge now i i am a very firm believer and this is something that i learned <coughs> in my time in the navy and this is something that uh it could be weird to some of you guys but i am a very firm believer that if you you know came across something that is you know that looks challenging right that is uh overwhelming to you at a start if you choose to avoid it one day one fine day that obstacle or if i mean that that demon will come right back and slap you across the face and that is where it hurts the most really so I learned this through my time in Navy where there's something that I do not want to do and I you know, refuse to do. I outright refuse to do it. And because of it, you know, it came back hard. And one time, at one time, it did sabotage the entire mission for my team members. And, you know, while they do not know what is the exact cause of it, but I know because I'm the one who, you know, who could not deliver and I own it up. I told them, say, hey guys, I apologize. And you know, I I messed up because I I wasn't prepared well enough, and as a result, we all uh, have to pay for it. And I'm truly sorry about it. And even in the online business, you know, there are times again I mentioned this time over time that I'm not tech savvy, right? And I, I choose to avoid it if I can. And what is the demon that came back and slapped me when it comes to the creation of pages and whatnot? I find that oh, damn. I need to do this, I need to get this done. And I do not know how to do it. Oh crap, what should I do? And because of that, it placed a lot of stress on myself and on my wallet because I have to outsource. Uh, and trust me, when you want to outsource something, you want to get something done in a short amount of time, it is costly as heck. So let that be a, a reminder to you guys. If you guys aren't prepared enough, prepared to burn some uh, hard-earned money to get the job done otherwise things will just escalate in the the way that you do not want it to be all right so what i have then uh realized and this is something that i actually i actively do right is i take the other approach and i go to the challenge so instead of avoiding those demons avoiding my those obstacles I tackle them head on because I know, and I know this for a fact, the moment I can overcome these demons, these obstacles, those challenges, is the day that it will never, never be an issue anymore. Take this in mind. If you were to go to the challenge, you overcome it, it's a one-time thing. It, it really is it's a one-time thing. The moment you overcome that obstacle, that challenge, it will no longer be an obstacle to you. But if you choose to avoid it, it will become a reoccurring problem because it will just keep haunting you and haunting you. And one day again, you will just come right back and give you that slap. And that, again, it's, it stings. It really stings. So going to the challenge and face it straight on, it's going to do you a lot of favors. And again, I know some of you guys may say, hey, Bill, but, you know, some of us have told you that you should edit your videos, you know, add some music, blah, blah, blah. I apologize, really. I, I do apologize. And see, this way I, I am avoiding it. I'm avoiding this particular issue. And people have came back to slap me repeatedly. I'm working on it. Trust me, I am working on it. <laughs> but again, uh, I will definitely be more. This is like a, this is a, this is like a you know, like an open confession, if I may. I am actively learning and I will 
promise to deliver better quality video you know so it's much more uh it has a much more professional settings if i may again see everybody has their challenges i have i i just told you guys one of my main uh challenge that people have been telling me and it came and slapped me a lot of time even my partner's like hey bill come on man so you see this is uh, a real life example and it's not me you know concocting a story out of nowhere this is a real again i i, I said it at the, at the very beginning of this video it's a conversation between me from me to you and this is something that i am definitely working on so if you guys are watching this video at a time of uh the when it, this video goes goes live i am still working on it but if you guys happen to stumble across this video in months and years down the road and I still haven't made any changes. <sighs> then yeah, I have some explaining to do. <laughs> All right, but uh, I the point is, you know, going to the challenge, facing your 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 demons, obstacle up straight up, is gonna do you a lot of favor because just remember this particular part. The moment you overcome them, those challenges, those obstacles, for one time, right? Oh my nose is here, one time, you overcome them permanently. But if you avoid them, right, they will always be haunting you reoccurringly. And those are the kind of recurring payment payments, recurring payments that we don't like and we do not want to have. Right? Get it done once and once and for all and move on to the next stage. Because the beauty about going to the challenge and overcoming them is very it's a one stone Q2 situation. You overcome the challenge, not only will it stop haunting you. It will propel you and allow you open the gates for you to move on to the next step and do the, the more advanced stuff the higher level stuff and again from a personal story from a personal point of view it is true because i managed to overcome some of the things that i don't like to do and it has you know brought me a, a long way and you guys may not have a hear about this before because i talk about this in my early videos i do not like to be on camera how ironic right like most of my videos now you guys can see my face and i am well awkward in front of the camera at the very start um, i'll maybe share this story some other time again i did share this before but i just want to let you guys know i used to have this issue where whenever a camera is pointed at me this is what i do I'll squint. My eyes will keep squinting like crazy. It's like a nervous, it's like a nervous sign, a nervous a kick. And uh, it has been caught on film before and it still haunts me to this day. But again, video marketing is powerful. And to build your brand, you know, people have to see you, have to hear you, and have to know you, at least via the camera. And because I managed to overcome this obstacle, this challenge, I tackle it head on and just say screw it for the greater good for my business for my goals place myself on a camera keep talking uploading videos daily and it helped and it worked it did work in my favor so I hope you know another of this life story makes sense to you guys and it, it felt more relatable okay so yeah that is all I have for this video you know I hope this video makes sense to you guys and if it didn't I hope you like share subscribe Feel free to comment, let me know thoughts about you guys want to hear from me next or what kind of stories that you guys want to hear from me next that I can uh, relate back to the affiliate journey that I'm going through right now or anything make money on I related. I'll do my best to share all these tips and tricks with you guys and, you know, do my best to, you know, provide free information and value to you guys as much as I can. All right, so until next time, I hope everybody have a nice day. Stay safe, stay healthy. Remember to wear a mask. Take care of the loved ones and I'll speak to you guys in my next video. Cheers.